There is a special division, a bully board division, for the big guys, the heavy guys, the football's favorite. The only way you can get one of these boards is to earn it. And you gotta battle all these other big boys just 50 and over. So it's a good challenge. Good. It's a good show. The best way to describe bully boarding is like um, the Hawaiian water bumper cars. You can crash bang and and it's all good. <laughs> Anything goes, party wave, whatever. Everybody banging each other, do your best. And it's like no matter what, you're laughing. You're laughing the whole way from the second you drop in to the second you hit the beach. Good fun. First thing I'm gonna do is try to run them over. And then they're gonna try to run me over. Buggers on the town, though, like Keone, Carolina is relentless. I don't know how many bully boards that guy won. Like, he needs another one. Love bully boarding at McCall with all the family and friends. Get together, get out there, throw all the camaraderie on the beach, get serious in the water, and start running each other over, having a good time. It's awesome, love it. I'm sure, you better come out and enjoy with us. Tandem bully boarding, you know, you got a partner. So it makes it a little bit extra harder to get on the waves, to maneuver together. But you know what I mean? You get to share the laughs. Definitely share the laughs. Bully board, bully board, ripping through the waves. Why he bouts or over the falls would only be a days. Bully board, bully board, will put you in the face. Why don't you try their big It's like, that takes a little bit different skill, huh? Get that board on rail, shifting weight around, and you have a partner. It's particularly a great time with my wife, you know, like we get to go out and do something together and share the share the moment together on the wave. Uh, uh, back in the day she was about seven, eight months pregnant and we went on and did this division on a good six, eight foot day. People thought we were crazy, but that daughter, she's so much more ma'a to the ocean than any of them. And maybe there's something to do with that. What you need all right, here's the biggest and the baddest guys in the water. I don't know if you'd run these guys over, because they be like a huge of people. And this is a corner of brewing. So it's all about liquid aloha. Yeah, liquid. These guys got lots of liquid. I like the 425. Right? Plenty of aloha. There you go. <laughs> 400. This is going to be me 400. Anyway, in sixth place. Ele, Kili Ikoa. So everything in that bag is a uh, triple X and 48. All right. In fifth place, at 425 pounds, the Kaika Van Giesel. Yeah, one year he won this division when he was 285 pounds. <laughs> in fourth place. Daniel Zonka! Right out there. In third place, Nalu Forsen! Alright, last two guys, they're cringing right now. In second place, Mel Keave! 
the baddest, baddest guy in the in the ping pong, John Paul. <laughs> Oh, not again. But I, I would just like to say thank you to Uncle Buck and Anthony Momi and other Kilangs that put this contest on. Is Where else you can see on contest with you got to be over 250 just to enter. <laughs> so thank you for making a division for us to have some fun and play it. Love you guys. Thank you for everything. They get plenty here. Yeah, oh, yeah. Yeah. All right. All right. All right. Okay, bully board tandem fight. Great, great competition. Oh, it's a, it's a couples competition. Right there we go. Yeah, we get the most entries on this one too. Yeah. I think. Yeah. <laughs> oh no, yeah. Oh, shut up. You thought you was being like a cougar. A cougar, I like to catch you. Chicka chicka down down. <laughs> All, right. All right, in fourth place, Miku Uemura and Ants de Butiako. In third place, Makamai de Soto and Kimi Eric Miner. In second place, Dwayne and Malia de Soto. And winning the Bully Boy Tandem, Keone Kialana and Kathy the Cougar Tirana. Thank you, everybody. I lost my wish. Making trouble this weekend, so glad to be here.